industries. We've got it. Good evening, Livia Regano with tonight's weather. A damp and blustery day for much of Queensland with only fleeting patches of blue sky, though noticeably brighter west of the ranges. Tomorrow afternoon we start to transition to drier, calmer weather and certainly by Thursday we'll enjoy more consistent sunshine. The town of 1770 had the biggest overnight rainfall of 51 millimetres, but we also had 34 mils in Gaborian, Miriam Vale had 33, Harvey Bay 19 mils and Rainbow Beach 15. With cloud and rain comes milder temperatures by day, but warmer nights for the very same reason. In Bundaberg today, the range was 20 to 29 degrees. To the satellite loop now, lots of cloud again today. It is a fairly unstable atmosphere, but mostly east of the Great Dividing Range. It's a deep, moist southeasterly flow, and it's quite cold up top, which helps the overturning of air, and that's what we need to get these showers. Inland, as you can see, it's mostly clear. On today's chart, we still have a steady southeast wind and it's quite strong, solid high in the Tasman Sea. It is starting to recede, but it's still very strong. And we've got a strong wind warning basically uh, for all coastal waters up to uh, Townsville or at least Cardwell, that's the border, uh, less so going north. On tomorrow's chart, the strong wind warning contracts just to Sunday and Capricorn Coast waters. Elsewhere, you can see the isobars are starting to spread apart and the winds will start to drop. It'll be the last day where we'll get quite consistent showers, though. On the outlook chart, finally you see the ridge of high pressure break down completely as the next trough comes in from the west. This means the southeasterlies reduce dramatically and start to turn more northerly inland. Temperatures rise and skies clear up. Now, the latest from the Weather Bureau, the boating forecast for Harvey Bay Waters. Southeast winds 15 to 20 knots all day tomorrow, then just 10 to 15 on Thursday and Friday, much the same. Gary offshore waters, southeast east reaching just short of warning strength tomorrow, 25 knots on a two metre swell. Thursday's winds dropping below 20 and Friday 10 to 15 from the southeast to east. Tomorrow is one day short of full moon, so we have a very big morning tide to contend with. Not quite as mighty as the new moon king tide two weeks ago, but not far off. The Wide Bay Burner District, a 50-50 chance of showers tomorrow and there could be storms in the north. Bundaberg, 21 up to 28 degrees, 27 for Gympie. Harvey Bay and Meribah, 28 again. And looking ahead for Bundy, there's a general trend towards calmer, clearer weather starting this Thursday and well underway by Friday, accompanied by a subtle rise in daytime temperatures. Have a nice evening and now it's back to the team. Thank you, Liv. Well, that wraps it up. Lovely having your company and we'll look forward to seeing you tomorrow night. Don't forget, if you'd like to watch anything again, our 7 Plus app or catch up on our page, 7news.com.au. Take care. Good night. Tonight, a husband charged over an alleged Valentine's